This is what's left of a large homeless encampment buried in the woods off North Columbia Boulevard in the St. John's neighborhood. PBOT crews remove vehicles, some of them stolen, from the encampment that's been years in the making, formerly known as Grace's Oasis. This is the site that was charging campers rent to illegally squat on government-owned property. It's taken a toll on all the businesses out here. I mean, it's not helping. Jeff White runs Kurt's RV and storage right next door. Those living at the camp have targeted his business by breaking in and stealing from him numerous times, and he spent months reporting it to the city. It's been way too long. I know there's camps everywhere, but it's been like six, eight months. That's how long it's taken the city to respond to this camp. But every car, every trailer, a home. It's a very hectic atmosphere here in this homeless camp off North Columbia Boulevard as PBOT crews remove dozens of broken down cars, even things like this large boat. Now, friends of those living in this camp are frantically trying to help the homeless pack up their things before the city forces them out for good. This definitely does not help on the road to getting our life back on our feet at all. Brian McKenzie has lived here I for six months. We'll probably just leave for a couple nights and come back after it's clean. Really? Really, that's how everybody does it. In North Portland, Blair Best, KGW News.